What's up everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Abby Aslan. If you are new here and you have not seen my face before or any of my videos, you should totally click the subscribe button down below so you can see all my upcoming videos in the future. This video is super exciting because it is one that has been requested by most of you and it's kind of just like a standard if you're in college to do this video, so I thought why not do it. It's going to be a What's in My Backpack 2017 College Edition video. Um, I'm really excited to do this because I've used the same backpack for a long time and I like it a lot so I can share that with you all. I can just share with you all what I put in my backpack um, pretty much on a daily basis. Obviously some things change like a different binder might be in my backpack or something. Be sure to give this video a huge thumbs up if you do enjoy it and leave all your video requests down below. I will pretty much do anything and everything so definitely leave any ideas you may have for me down below. It can be college related. I'm thinking of doing a Q&A um, pretty soon because the last one I did I had like a thousand subscribers and I, now that I have like a lot more people there might be more questions that want to be asked or different questions and I just wanted to say thank you all so much for 6,000 subscribers like it's just unreal like I love you all so much you guys are the best and I'm so thankful for each and every one of you for just supporting me and my channel so yeah let's just go ahead and get right into the video so this right here is my backpack it's very heavy right now oh my gosh my back hurts so bad because I just walked like through the rain for like a mile to my car from where I was on campus and this thing is so heavy so my shoulders are just like done right now but this is my backpack it's just like a navy blue color and it has purple accents and it's from North Face and I've actually had this since my senior year of high school I used it all of my senior year of high school all of my freshman year of college and I plan on keeping it the rest of college honestly unless it falls apart so we'll just go ahead and start with the side pockets of my backpack so in the left side pocket I have my hydro flask which I recently got like right before the school year started and I love it a lot it keeps my water very very cold and it doesn't leak at all if it spills over which is awesome and then in my right pocket this is where I normally keep like my keys and sunglasses and stuff um, so right now I just have my keys in there and I don't have any sunglasses in there today just because it's very rainy outside so there's no need for sunglasses I also have a granola bar which is just like an emergency granola bar if i get hungry in between classes or something i also have a little thing of hand sanitizer that's easy access if i just really need to clean my hands or if i've used the bathroom or something and now we will go into this front pocket it has two pockets one is like a smaller one and then there's a bigger compartment that has a um laptop area too but i really like this backpack because it just has like tons and tons of compartments there's one right here and it's velcro and inside this velcro one i have a lot i have my Smith's Rosebed Solve. I have um, some Aquaphor for just like if my lips are like in insanely chapped. A pad of sticky notes, a bookmark, headphones, pepper spray, very important, and a pencil. Oh, I wanted y'all to see the compartment, that's why I had to stand up for that part. But then next, I'm just going to go into this little compartment right here that is in front of this Velcro strapped one that I just went through. And in there, I have a packet of index cards because if I'm studying somewhere out, in public and I need to just memorize some things they are good to have. I have a lot more sticky notes which is good whenever I'm reading my textbooks. And then in the compartment next to it which is literally like the exact same thing, I have um, two packs of gum just for like if I had coffee or something and I really need to freshen my breath. And then in front of the two other compartments there are like little slots for pens and pencils. So I just have a pencil, a pen, and another pen. And then there's this like little netted um, area right here. And typically I normally just keep like something random right there. Like there might be hand sanitizer or like my SD card if I'm out editing videos. And then there's two little compartments right here, but I actually don't put anything in them. And then just in the rest of it, in this big open spot, I keep my TI-84 calculator and this note card um, holder. And inside of it are just blank note cards that I have not used yet. And that is it for this front compartment. And now we'll move on to the bigger one. So in this very large compartment, it holds a lot of stuff. And that's one of the things I absolutely love about this backpack. You can fit so much in here. Um, and the straps are adjustable and that's nice when they're padded. So it's super duper um, comfortable. The only thing that sucks is if you do have a ton of stuff and you have to walk very long distances, like a mile or something, then your back is gonna hurt if you have a lot in your backpack. But in this big compartment, it's just kind of like a mess. But I just have um, my iPhone like charger. I don't really have the box on it just to plug into my computer in case my phone dies when I'm out in public. I typically like to bring this with me in case I'm on campus all day long. And then I have this really cute little pouch that I've been using for a very long time um, to hold all my pens, pencils, highlighters, and all that good stuff. And it is from World Market. I believe it's only like $6 too. So if you want to go get like a really big um, pencil pouch that can like fold up and everything that holds a lot and is cheap, definitely check out World Market. 
and I just keep um, highlighters in here. I keep all my pens, um, some whiteout, and my little clicker for class that is extremely overpriced. And then I also have this actual pencil pouch that I've had probably since middle school. And in here, I honestly don't use it much. I thought that it's nice to have them. There's like feminine products in here in case I ever need them. I have some Calvin Klein mascara that's probably three years old some um, baby lips chapstick and I have a checkout slip from high school from when I checked out of school on November 25th of 2016 at 1240 so that's nice and then next up in the big compartment this is like when the actual like books and notebooks come into play um, I keep my planner in here I have another planner as well but I typically bring this one with me because it is just um, a lot more thinner and more compact and um, it kind of just fits in there like a notebook does and I just love having this with me if I need to write down an event or something I have it there with me I try and bring it to school with me as much as I can so this is always good to have and carry around with me and if y'all are wondering this is the day designer by Target um, brand of planner and it was only ten dollars next up I have a notebook I actually have not used this notebook yet just kidding I lied I see writing um, <laughs> this is my marketing notebook I did not know that it's from my class yesterday I just haven't taken it out yet um, I did not have classes today, so the, but I do have like things in here from when I was studying last night and when I was planning on studying today um, on campus. So that's just kind of like what's in here, but of course it changes out. Like if I have different classes, it's going to be different notebooks, but it's generally the same stuff. And then next up, I have this binder, which is my business finance binder. I am taking business finance as a hybrid class, so I have to take it online. And I was planning on doing some of this work at Starbucks this morning, but I decided I wanted to come home instead and do it. So I have this with me and it has the notebook stuck inside of it. This is a great way to save space um, and not get your notebooks ruined if y'all are wondering to stick it in like sideways or whatever to whatever um, class it goes with. And then next up in this um, sleeve, like there's a ton of open space and then there's like a little Sorry. sleeve. I'm having trouble understanding right now. I didn't even say Please try that. a little later. Yeah, so in this big open space, there is a um, compartment that is perfect for your laptop and that is where I keep my laptop. I really don't like bringing my laptop on campus with me honestly, especially because if it like ever pours down rain out of nowhere, I risk getting it like wet through the backpack and I just don't really like carrying it because it is so heavy and adds so much weight to my backpack, but a lot of times I do have to take it. So that is why I have my laptop in there. And this is a MacBook Pro by the way, it is the 13 inch, um, I don't know how much storage it is, it's like the second, the smallest storage and it is the MacBook Pro 13 inch of Retina display. And the stickers are from Redbubble and the black marble case is from Amazon. And that is everything in my backpack. It is now completely empty. I love it so much. I definitely recommend North Face backpacks. Um, they put them on sale like quite a bit too. I know I got mine on sale right before school started um, going into my uh, senior year. So it was definitely a great investment. It was only around like $60 I think when I got it on sale. It might've been a little bit cheaper but it's just really important to have a good backpack that has good support and can hold a lot because when you're in college, sometimes you have classes all day long and you have to carry all your textbooks and just binders and notebooks with you. And I know in my school supplies haul, y'all are probably wondering where my like black portfolio thing is that I said I was going to use in replacement of binders, but unfortunately, every single one of my textbooks this year is loose leaf, and if y'all didn't know, loose leaf textbooks in college are not binded so they're literally just like hole punched pages and they come in like tight plastic wrap and when you undo the plastic wrap it's all like literally like if you drop it it goes everywhere so you have to have a binder um, to hold it together so I had to purchase a bunch of binders and now I have a bunch of binders unfortunately I really didn't want them because they just take so much space but I still do use a portfolio for um, the papers from my classes and for like any kind of worksheets or study guides or anything like that that we use. That is it for my what's in my backpack video. I hope you all enjoyed it so much and be sure to give it a thumbs up like I said before if you did like it. And be sure to subscribe if you have not already and I will see you all in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. I love you guys. Bye.